Hey everyone, welcome to Global Reports. I'm your anchor Josh, with a mind-blowing story from China where they've just launched the world's first 10G broadband network. This is internet so fast it grabs a two-hour movie in seconds and it's setting a new global standard. If you're wondering how China built this lightning-fast network and what it means for the future, let's dive into the journey from their bold plans to the big reveal in April 2025. So grab a seat and let's get rolling. China was already a broadband leader by the early 2020s with gigabit speeds in many cities, but they wanted to redefine what fast means. In 2021, the government's five-year plan laid out a vision for ultra-high-speed networks targeting 10 gigabits per second, which is a speed that could handle the wildest tech dreams. They saw artificial intelligence and virtual reality and smart cities on the horizon, all needing massive bandwidth to thrive. China also aimed to outshine competitors like the US and Europe who were sketching out their own high-speed plans. To make this happen, they leaned on telecom giants Huawei and China Unicom, who started testing 10G technology in labs around 2022 using advanced fiber optics and a system called XGS Pawn to push data at unprecedented rates. Building a network this ambitious wasn't simple since it demanded new cables and equipment plus a skilled workforce to wire up China's vast landscape. Decades of laying fiber gave them a head start, and government subsidies with strict deadlines kept the momentum going strong. By 2023, trials in tech hubs like Shanghai and Shenzhen hit 5 gigabits per second, showing they were on the verge of something huge. Turning this vision into reality took serious tech and effort as China worked to create a network that could deliver 10 gigabits per second to homes and businesses. Huawei led the charge, spending years refining 50 g pon technology, which allows fiber cables to carry enormous data loads while maintaining stability. They paired this with smart routers and AI systems that predict network congestion and fix issues before users notice ensuring a seamless experience. On the infrastructure side, China had laid over 2 million kilometers of fiber by 2025, which is enough to circle the earth 50 times and gave them a solid foundation. The government made 10G a national priority, pouring funds into pilot projects and training thousands of engineers to install high-capacity cables. In January 2025, the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology announced pilot programs for key areas like residential communities and industrial parks, setting the stage for a full rollout. These pilots tested speeds up to 5,000 megabits per second, with uploads above 1,000 megabits per second, proving the tech was ready for prime time. Meanwhile, other countries like the US were still running 10G trials with companies like Comcast and AT&T lagging behind China's commercial leap. The world took notice on April 19, 2025, when Huawei and China Unicom flipped the switch on the first 10G broadband network in Xiang'an, a high-tech zone near Beijing built as a model for China's smart city future. This wasn't just a test, but a live network delivering download speeds of 9,834 megabits per second and uploads of 1,008 megabits per second, which is fast enough to download a 4K movie in seconds or stream 150 at once. Social media posts on X buzzed with excitement as one user compared it to grabbing Netflix's entire library in a snap. The network uses next-generation fiber optics and AI to manage data flow, keeping it reliable even under heavy demand. Xiong'an's buildings were wired from the ground up with 10G cables, making it the perfect launchpad. This debut also carried weight beyond tech as China's rivalry with the US intensified amid trade tensions and chip bans. Huawei's role showed they could innovate under pressure, and China Unicom's rollout expertise promised rapid expansion to other cities. So what does this mean for everyday life? In Xiong'an, 10G is a game-changer letting residents play lag-free virtual reality games and stream ultra-high-definition classes without a hiccup. Businesses can process AI data in real-time boosting efficiency for tasks like video editing or 3D design, where uploading huge files now takes moments. Cloud gaming shines as 10G makes it feel like the game's running locally, which is a dream for gamers. China's bigger plan is to power smart cities with self-driving cars and AI-driven traffic systems, or connected hospitals sharing data instantly, all relying on 10G's bandwidth. Posts on X hint that Beijing suburbs could see 10G soon, suggesting fast growth though costs might be a snag since subscriptions could outprice regular broadband. 
Globally, this puts pressure on other nations as China's success sets a new benchmark prompting the US and Europe to speed up their own networks. It also bolsters Huawei's reputation proving they can lead despite international hurdles and could shift how the world views China's tech prowess. China's not hitting the brakes as they plan to bring 10G to major cities like Beijing and Shanghai by 2026, while rural areas will need more time and investment to catch up. The next five-year plan starting in 2026 will likely double down on tech, with Huawei already exploring 50 g pon systems that could push speeds to 50 gigabits per second in the future, which is almost unthinkable today. Trade tensions with the U.S. pose risks, since tighter chip restrictions could disrupt Huawei's supply chain and the cost of scaling 10G nationwide is steep. Yet China's track record of turning ambition into reality suggests they'll forge ahead with the resources and determination to keep their edge. This 10G network isn't just about speed, but about shaping a digital future where smart cities and AI thrive and China leads the way. Whether they stay ahead depends on how they navigate these challenges, but for now they've set a high bar. That's the story of China's 10G broadband triumph, which has taken them from bold plans to the world's fastest internet in just a few years. The launch in Jiangan is a milestone that's changing lives and challenging the globe to keep up. It's a tale of innovation and vision, showing what's possible when a country goes all in on tech. Will 10G redefine our digital world? What do you think, viewers? Drop your thoughts below and let's keep the conversation going. This is Josh signing off. Stay curious and keep exploring.